sure what's going on up in here. Some sort of competition maybe. It says officials here. So this is called a royal run. As it says on this flag here, they've got this run going on. They spoke to the guy and he says there's you can take part in like a one kilometer, five kilometer and ten kilometer run and for sure it's gonna be along the city center. All the signups are finished so people seem to be just coming here and gathering their t-shirts, uh, the number. So I have to turn around and get to that shore there where the boats are to keep going, walking that way. A lot of people sunbathing up in here, chilling. Nice area, boom. There's a type of deal, just sit down whenever, yeah. do whatever, like sunbathe, go swimming, eat or just sit down, chat. Let's have a look here. This is some cool looking square. It's like a little low key out of that you know busy craziness people walking around and always in your face area where you can just sit lie down yes that's what we're talking about let's bring some life up in here have a look at this village as well look at that so the way they build they've got this what it appears to be exposed structure but obviously that is by the design done like this on purpose you see what i mean For the purpose of the artistic expression these almost look like they plastic or artificial yeah but this is actually a real plant look look the color you see look at that here what is exposed to the sun is much brighter and then you dig inside and look the difference in the color so this is a glimpse of the copenhagen city center and surrounding areas it is nice it is nice to see and nice to be in this environment but all this sitting around and eating all day long is just way 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 overrated and foolishness but we all got choices to make and find our way so i let go of judging and saying one thing over the other and argue who's right who's wrong whatever we do including thinking because doing is not only you know physical doing stuff whatever we project it will have its consequences like everything it's up to you how you are going to live your life and it is a responsibility so take responsibility for yourself and here is david michelangelo statue of david right also i'm gonna make you have a look on the water so see these boats coming this way and then there's a boat farther coming that way so we've got right hand side traffic on the water meaning that we've got cardboard tuck which is one going towards us and as you can see here it's on the right hand side so that's your starboard this other boat coming the other way to the left from your point of view that is the port tack because they're on the left hand side right hand side is the starboard side left hand side is your port side we use that in you know sailing type of related activity and this is very common look on the metal buildings because that structure is metal and this color is not paint it's actually rust because we've got so much water and the water here is quite salty then we put the rust on a metal construction like for instance here on those steel rings they do rust Well, surprise, surprise. Let's see what type of flag is on this yacht. That's like a massive yacht. It looks like a cruise ship, but it's not. And that is the dum -da -dum -dum -dum, the flag of the Jamaica. Amazing. Yeah, man. You know what would be good to do of that? Guess what? <laughs> Kite surf. Yeah, it would be cool. Just launch off that cruiser and go for a nice session in the middle of the ocean. Woo! For sure. Strapless. Kite surf. This is a nice little park. Right in this harbor. Really nice, really cool. Okay, I'm gonna look into finding this little mermaid. Where is she hiding? And again, look at the seaweed. Look at all that. 
That's mud lot seaweed. And there's a swan. Right there. So pretty much there in the distance on the other side where you can see those wind turbines. Right there, so I'm talking about that way. Is the part of the city where I am contemplating if I should move there with my car. Where basically, you know, all the all that beach is. And when I was on that other side, you could see those wind turbines as well from that other side. Also, if you look just here, we found the little mermaid. There she is, she's kind of looking away. We've got a very similar statue in the town where I came from, in Poland. I'll show you all the videos. Look at this monument with this angel. We're gonna leave this docks and back into the city center, go towards that way. Quick view. Saw the mermaid. Let's go into the city again. So this bridge will lead us to this fortress. Uh, let's go in. You know, like some people, they just want to be in your camera. Like, <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, they just walk towards you like, like they just want to be in the camera. Like. Some people get it a little bit, you know. Skittles. Let's see these beautiful swans with the babies. Wow. And again, look at the seaweed. I'm not sure if you can see the fish. I can see it. Right here. And then look at the swan with the baby. They're actually chewing on that seaweed. But that serves the purpose. They got some food. And then the fish here. If you can see, they're also chewing on that seaweed. It's actually good that it's here. We're going in fortress of Denmark. <laughs> this is the gate to come out, or you can obviously come in this way and then come out the way that we came from. So basically we just went through the fortress. There's the side bits which you just saw and then you can walk on top of the hill in that shape of the star. And here it looks like we've got some actually soldiers guarding the entry and exit. Check out the abs, check out the abs. <laughs> Another museum, museum of Denmark. Let's look what's here. Okay, another little square. Let's go. This is the church of the Christ. In all the European capitals, there's this thing with big massive doors in city centers. And you can see that like across Europe, in all the capitals, these big gates. And it's not the gates so much which I'm on about, it's the doors, yeah? The doors which leads to certain places, to certain buildings around city center area. And they're just like massive doors. There's for sure something that we not get told about. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Check out this bike, Yamaha. So down the bottom of the street, far there, this yellow building. We're gonna get closer to them in a minute. We've got this ex naval accommodation used back in the day. So it's marked on maps as one of the landmarks worth seeing. This is a little cool. The entrance to a basement, or maybe someone lives there. But this is how the architecture of a lot of Copenhagen look like so this bricky 
buildings. 